Good morning. It started at 6.15 this morning. Um, it's day 51. After that unexpected Nero yesterday, like 3.6 miles of the storm, I'm back on the trail, headed over that ridge, Franconia Ridge. And it should be a nice clear day out, um, especially in the morning here. Probably be windy up there though. I don't think I've ever seen a ridge not be windy, uh, at least in my experience. But uh, we did get a thunderstorm, it rolled through about two o'clock, and, and then it got sunny again, and it was like clear out, it was nice, so I was like, oh man, maybe I should just go back out, you know? It was probably like 3.30 or something by that point. And then it got dark again, cloudy, thunderstormy again, um... A little bit later that night about maybe six or seven um, yesterday night and a little bit of a thunderstorm again uh, with some rain all in all it really wasn't that bad I mean of course you know on the on the ridge it could have been ten times worse nobody knows you know because I wasn't up there nobody should have been up there but uh, got about nine point eight miles I think today or something to get into town and that's Lincoln where we have reservations at the Notch Hostel so I made those last night in the tent with my little <laughs> one bar of service it was spotty but uh people are probably wondering how come I haven't uploaded a video well I have been I have been in the woods for seven days straight without going to town. So that's the reason why I haven't uploaded a video. I can't until I get to town and I have internet or some sort of fast service. So each file is anywhere from you know one to three gigs. It just takes a long time to upload those. I don't really want to take a zero tomorrow. But I might have to because I had to upload a bunch of videos, do thumbnails. Um, if I can get into town and get stuff uploaded, maybe what I'll do is I'll upload a few videos, get a resupply done, and then not take a zero and just kind of do a Nero tomorrow. Um, there's about 25 miles I need to get through in the next little leg there. It should only take three days. And... That'll get me out of the whites and all of the big mountains. So, as you can see, I got a big up here. So I'm going to put the phone away and uh, get over this ridge. I'll take some video up there, of course. A little view of Franconia. Just a little portion of it, anyway. Cloud cover right now, but doesn't look like it's going to last. It'll probably burn off by the time I get there. So, um, I, hope, I, don't think this, I think this is the only viewpoint, too. Before I get up there. It's pretty early still. It's not clear enough. I think it's Washington in the background, but I might be wrong. But this is getting towards the top of the ridge and it's still foggy, cloudy up there. That's not even the top. It's moving too fast before it can burn off, but I'm not going to waste any time today. It's the top of La Fayette over here. Got some runners. Nothing on their backs. That's how they do the run so fast. Uh, you get to the top of La Fayette, you have a last ditch emergency shelter down there. It's a mile down. So. Gotta go all the way down there. That's Greenleaf Hut, if I'm not mistaken. So, alright, I'm gonna make my way up to Lafayette now. That's Washington, I think, in the back. Down there. 
off trail, by the way, so thinking about that, it doesn't count. <laughs> Still two more mountains to go, but we gotta go to Liberty Springs campsite. I'm not staying there, but that's where we're headed, so. Uh, a white blaze right there. Gotta go down to go up. Uh, I think there's another peak on the other side of that one as well to go up. Three mountains today. On top of Lafayette right now, about to head down. Stack, but this is little. This is Lincoln. Just having a little fun. Has nothing on me. Why, why do I do stuff like this? Oh man. Seriously, Franconia Ridge is awesome. One of the best ridges I've done. It's not hard either. It's just, it's actually a really pleasant ridge. So, I think that's a little haystack over there. And that's where I'm going next. And then get to what? Or guess what? I get to go down. Down, down, down. Yeah, what do we got? A little view. I think that's through. I don't know what road that is, but probably going there next. Let's go to one of town. Oh, I don't know where Moose Lock is, but guess what, Moose Lock? You're about to get defeated. Yeah, I'm gonna put these 4Ks behind me and get truck in over the next few days. All right. A little river crossing here. Nice. Morning or afternoon? Yeah. Afternoon. I 
am not going on that today. That is for tomorrow, possibly, but I'm going to the Flume Visitor Center, which is 0.9, which sucks, but it's, there should be a road walk. For anybody that wonders what that highway is, that's highway, it's highway 93. Shout out to James, the truck driver. He knows what 93 is and 90. Made good time today. I'm still walking. <laughs> it's almost uh, almost 10 miles too. Uh, it's only it's only one something right now. If I get in, get everything done. Not everything done, but just charge up the phone, charge up the battery, charge up uh, all the stuff I need to charge up, upload three or four videos. I actually have about seven or eight videos I gotta upload, but I just can't get them all done probably in one night. If I can upload about three or four, that'll get me to the next section. And I don't know, if I can get all that stuff done, go go to the store, get refitted for about three days. I might go out tomorrow and just do a Nero tomorrow, like five miles tomorrow, and then try to do 10 and 10 and then get back to town. So, cause it's 25 miles through that next section to get to town and uh, be officially done with the whites. So, kicked New Hampshire in its ass. All right. Sitting here waiting for the shuttle to come pick me up. I'm at the uh, Flume Visitor Center. Um, take me over to the Notch Hostel. So it's about not even two o'clock. It's almost two o'clock. Uh, so I get there at a decent time. I might be able to get refit and get stuff done and uh, go to the store. We'll see. Uh, I've been to this hostel, but. Uh, it's like one of the number one people, uh, number one places people go to in this area. So we'll check her out. <laughs> 